I'm Fabian Woods, I'm a Noongar man from Perth and I'm very, very happy to be back here. I thought COVID was going to have its way with us, but we're going all right. You know, COVID's actually a dickhead at the moment. It has become Australia's new favourite C word, believe it or not. <laughs> I just want to say that I'm, yeah, very, very happy to be here. All my mob out there, if you've got a phone and recording for social media, please don't tag me. I told my work I was at a funeral. <laughs> I mean, no. <laughs> Don't laugh, I panic, I panic. I run out of leave and I've got no more bullshit to say to them. I'm sure, I'm sure they think that I've got like five more living relatives left. <laughs> sure is good. But hey, my work ethic is shit, you know. I'm not lazy, I just can't be fucked going to work, you know. <laughs> now listen, don't, all my people are not like me. I'm just a dickhead myself. Most of my people, you know, they study hard, they go to school, they work, and they get this beautiful white picket fence house, you know? That's what goes with our footy players, AFL and NRL. You know, they train hard, they work, you know, they, they, they're committed, they get into a team, and then they get a beautiful white wife. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to, while I'm on there, I just want to touch on the Black Fellow Lives Matter movement. I was driving along, like, the cops these days, with black, the BLM, they are really friendly. I don't know how I feel about that, you know? I should be feeling like an elder commercial, you know, like good different. But I was driving along. <laughs> <laughs> I was driving, I was driving along, I was blue drunk, I come from the casino, I was pissed. I had my phone in my hand, you know, Facebooking it up. I had a can in my other hand. I was skewering my, you know, skewering my legs like that. <laughs> and I bloody go over the hill, didn't bang a booze bus. And I think, ah, oh, shit, here we go. And the copper, he sees me, knowing what's going on with, you know, Black Lives Movement. He's seen me look at him, and he just looked at me, and I look back at him. I replied to a comment, and I look back at him, <laughs> and he just said, nah, fuck it, just keep coming, mate, keep coming. I am not about to get on YouTube, mate, just keep coming, keep coming. Yeah, I can see the beer in your lap, yeah, yeah, how original. Oh, and there's eight children ducking down in the back seat. Oh, I've never seen that before. Oh, and his tail light is out. Cool, mate. Yeah, have a good one. Have a good one. Ah, <laughs> oh, jingoes, Ernie dingoes. Um, like, like I said, I come from Perth. Uh, me and my family, we enjoy going to the beach. We, um, but we always, we're always joined by our auntie, Auntie Beryl. Now, she is a big, beautiful black woman, you know? And... Correct me if I'm lying, blackfellas. Every one of our big, beautiful black women, behind them is a skinny black man, right? Am I right? <laughs> now, this is my auntie. She is loud and she is fucking proud and she does not give a shard of shit what anyone thinks about her, you know? She rocks up to the beach, her and my little skinny uncle. She is wearing a big teeny. And fucking, <laughs> he's walking next to her and I swear to God, I would not lie to you, fellas. They look like the number 10 walking along. <laughs> <laughs> so wrong, so wrong, so wrong. No, not, not, not them, I'm not trying to shade. The sarong she was wearing, you know, you'll you'll unveil, he gets unveiled that, that night. Hey, listen, I'm time's up. I just want to get one more favour from you guys. You've been an awesome, awesome crowd. When I count to three, can you please say daddy? Daddy is a word we use for, um, you know, excellent. Right, let me fix my phone up. All right, Daddy on three, ready? One, two, three. Daddy! Ah, thank you, Melvin.